Hi, I'm Julie Schiffman, and I'm an EFT practitioner at Dr. Mercola's Center for Natural Health. I'm going to show you a tool today which can help you in various aspects of your life. It's called Emotional Freedom Technique, also known as tapping. Tapping is a tool that can help you to overcome negative beliefs, negative emotions, negative thought patterns, and help you to replace them with positive thoughts, positive feelings, help you to feel calm and relaxed. Today we're going to use EFT for anxiety. We all know what it feels like to feel anxious at times. We all know what it feels like to feel stressed. Our bodies are speaking to us constantly, all day long. And if you tune into your body, if you tune into how you're feeling, you maybe can even recognize some anxiety there. Many people carry anxiety in their abdomen or in their chest, sometimes in their throat or in their head. Tune into your body. See what your body is trying to tell you. Tune into your abdomen. Sometimes people feel like it's in knots or in butterflies. Sometimes people feel as though their chest is feeling heavy, like there's a weight on it. Tune into your shoulders, your neck, and your back. Tune into your head. Tune into your throat. Is it feeling heavy? Is there shallow breathing? On a scale of 1 to 10, I want you to tune in. 10 being you're in a full-blown panic attack or your stress level is really, really high. It's zero being you're on a beach somewhere, completely relaxed with not a care in the world. We're going to go through a tapping sequence today for anxiety. I'm going to show you the tapping points first, and then we're going to go through it together. The first point is the side of the hand. We call this the karate chop point, or the setup point. This is where we tap and we talk about what the problem actually is. We're tuning into the problem. It's a very gentle tapping. You don't want to hurt yourself. You can do it on either hand, on either side. It doesn't matter. What we're going to be tapping on are called meridians. And these are energy pathways throughout the body that help to calm and relax and restore balance in our body. The next point is going to be the top of the head. The next point is the inner eyebrow, just toward the bridge of the nose. The next point is the side of the eye, just on the bone there. The next point is under the eye, also on the bone. The next point is under the nose. And then on the chin, just on the cleft. The next point is underneath the collarbone point, which again you can use on either side. The next point is under the arm. And the last point is going to be the inside of the wrist to the inside of the wrist. And we're going to tap just like that, again, very gently. So I want you to tune into a problem. I want you to tune into what your body is trying to say to you. I want you to think about anxiety, where it's created in your body and what is causing it. I'm going to tell you exactly what to say and exactly where to tap. And all you have to do is repeat after me out loud. As always, please take responsibility for your own emotional well-being. We're going to get started. I want you to tap on the side of your hand on that karate chop point. And I want you to say, even though I'm feeling so anxious, I love and accept how I feel about this. Even though I have all this anxiety and I feel it in my stomach, my stomach's in knots, I have butterflies. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though sometimes it's hard to love and accept myself when I'm feeling this anxious about various things in my life, maybe it's about finances or relationships or my job, I love and accept how I feel about this. I'm open to feeling calm and relaxed as I release and let go. And now we're going to change points and we're going to tap on the top of your head. This anxiety in my body, and we're going to move to the inner eyebrow, this anxiety in my body, and on the side of your eyes, this anxiety is intense. And under your eye, I feel all this fear in my body and under your nose, it feels overwhelming. And on your chin, it feels out of control. 
and tap on your collarbone point, it feels like I don't have control over my body. And tap under your arm. It doesn't feel safe here. And tap again on the top of your head. I love and accept myself. And I'm open to releasing these emotions. And tap on your inner eyebrows. I'm not sure it feels safe to release these emotions. And tap on the side of your eyes. All this fear. And under your eyes, all this anxiety. And under your nose, I feel it in my body. I feel butterflies or I feel stress. And tap on your chin. I love and accept myself. I know what it feels like to feel calm. And tap on that collarbone point. I know what it feels like to feel calm. I'm allowing my body to feel calm. And tap under your arm, releasing the stress in my body. And again on the top of your head, releasing the stress in my body. And tap on your inner eyebrow, allowing my body to feel calm and relaxed and on the side of your eye, infusing my body with love and joy and peace and under your eye, regardless of the stress in my life right now. And tap under your nose. I'm, I'm able to own my power and tap on your chin. I have control of my body and on your chest, on the collarbone point, my stomach is feeling calmer more relaxed and under your arm as I let go and then I want you to tap your wrist together my whole body feels calmer and more relaxed as I release and let go and then what I want you to do is take a big deep breath in and let it go and tune in to how you're feeling now I want you to tune into your body, tune into your abdomen, tune into your chest, tune into your head, and go back to that number, go back to that place where you were before we started tapping. So if it was at a 7 or an 8 or a 10, what does that feel like now? Did it come down to a 0? Did it come down to a 4? Really tune into what that feels like. And if you feel like there is still stress and anxiety there, and there might be, because we did not get specific with what the anxiety is about. But tune into it again. And we're going to go through one more round. Tap on the side of your hand. Even though I still have this anxiety in my body, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this remaining anxiety in my body, it's hard to let it go. This anxiety has been with me for so long, I don't know how to release it. I love and accept how I feel about it. Even though I have this remaining anxiety, again, whether it's about finances, about a relationship, about public speaking, about a job, I deeply and completely love and accept who I am and how I feel about this. And I am open to letting go because I am safe and I have control over my thoughts and my feelings. And tap on the top of your head this remaining anxiety in my body. And tap over your eyebrows this remaining anxiety in my body. And on the side of your eyes this remaining anxiety. And under your eyes, I don't think I can let this go. And under your nose, I've had this anxiety forever. And on your chin, it doesn't feel safe for me to let it go. And tap on the collarbone point. It just doesn't feel safe. And tap under your arm. But instead of criticizing and judging myself about this anxiety, I'm choosing just to acknowledge that it's there. And on the top of your head, I'm acknowledging it. I recognize it. I can feel it and tap on your inner eyebrows. I spend so much time trying to ignore it, trying to pretend it isn't there, 
telling it to go away. I choose to just acknowledge it's there. I'm acknowledging the anxiety, acknowledging how it feels in my body, and it's okay. I accept myself even with this anxiety and with this fear. I'm just trying to protect myself. I love and accept myself. I love and accept that my body responds in this way. I love myself enough to let it go. Releasing the anxiety, taking control over my body, my thoughts, and my feelings as I let go. My whole body feels calmer, more relaxed. I'm breathing easy. My head feels light, free, and clear. My stomach feels relaxed as I let go. And take a big, deep breath in. And enjoy what it feels like to feel calm. <laughs>